and this is a farmer again and uh, we are in Atlanta, Illinois. We are visiting a beautiful farm. It's uh, the name of it. It's an earth prairie farm in prairie Illinois. Earth. Yeah. Prairie Earth Farm and it's Atlanta, Illinois. Um, uh, we are visiting Dave Bishop and he's organic grow up here. Thank you so much for growing organic. And uh, we want to ask him just a few questions after we run a demo. Uh, we clean some uh, wheat and soybeans over here. So Dave, uh, what was your expectation when we were coming to your farm? Well, our expectation was that uh, this new technology would be simple and easier to use. Uh, we, there is an increasing demand here for small-scale cleaning, both for just seed cleaning and also for cleaning grain to milk. And so we were just interested in seeing how this might work and meet the needs of uh, relatively small farmers or groups. Of okay, wonderful. And what do you say? Does the machine do the job? It does uh, appear to do the job and uh, we're very proud. Well, thank you for that. And uh, what do you think primary, you know, uh, people would use it for? A lot of it would just be cleaning seed to replant. We are raising more heritage type grains, older varieties. And uh, since seed is generally not available from commercial sources, uh, we would be growing our own seed, which means we would have to clean it. And of course, too, uh, with livestock, you have a good use for clean out to the low quality in. So if you can clean the seed enough to replant, first of all, run through the machine, and then the higher quality seeds germ better, you have better use of the high quality, but you also also have good markets of good use for low quality clean out. Okay. So that, gives, that adds value to the, to the grain germ. And what do you think the results you saw here between yeah. the soybean mm -hmm. and uh, the green so wheat would be that satisfactory or what uh, <laughs> your <laughs> expectations? Yeah, the soybeans were really, really dirty and so they did a good job of cleaning them out. That was that was probably a really good test. Yeah, I'm sorry we did some mess uh, over here. <laughs> yeah, there's, a, there's a lot of cockleburs here. Uh, and the wheat they cleaned it certainly adequate for uh, running to the drill, so that was no problem. The ability to take it through multiple times, uh, and I'm not an expert on cleaning for the milling industry, one of the other folks here is, is in that. But for the purposes that I would use it for, which is primarily to plant, it would do the job. Perfect, wonderful. And uh, after you saw uh, what you saw, would you be comfortable to maybe recommend it to your fellow friends farmers? I certainly would. I, I mean, uh, what we've seen here today in this demonstration, it, uh, it does the job as, as advertised. Okay, perfect. Right, so uh, thank you very much for coming out. And, and thank you for having us.